it's a holiday weekend. Uh, a lot of people are traveling and I was talking to this young lady the other day and she was like, Hey, um, we was talking about upcoming events and she said, yeah, cause I'm going out of town tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I said, you going? I said, oh, y'all going out of town? She was like, yeah, oh, no, I'm going out of town. I'm going out of town with my friends. And I said, oh, well, that's nice. Your husband let you go? She said, let me go. I said, yeah, he let you go? And she said, oh, I didn't ask. I, t I just told him I was going with my friends. Mm -hmm. I said, so, you, so the conversation was, you didn't say, hey, can I, do you mind if I go with my friends? You know, we're going to out of town, you know, we're going to Tennessee. And she said, no, it wasn't no asking. What's up, Tyler? She said, no, it wasn't any asking. I just told him, um, I got this trip that I'm going on and me and two of my other friends, we going on this trip and I see you when I get back on, on this week. Mm -hmm. So that poses a question to me. I, I'm not, I mean, I'm like, so you can just do that. I mean, she was like, yeah, I'm over 50 years old. No, nah, that don't make you just go on no trip, though. I can do that. She said, I'm over 50 years old. My my mom and daddy is such and such, such and such. Mm. What's and up, I'm story? Going. So. But that don't make you go on no trip because you, you're a certain age. Okay. So, so what I'm saying to you, is that okay? That, you know, because T just asked me, you know, hey, we ought to take a girl's trip. Hmm. So I was she like, always getting up these girl trips. <laughs> oh, and Tina. And I look around, y'all talking about a girl trip. We didn't go. I we never had no guy trip. We ain't went on no girl trip. Y'all ain't went on a trip. Y'all been somewhere. We just been up there to the winery. Well, that that's enough. No, I it's saw not. All pictures on there. Yeah, we just went to the winery. All kicking around, throwing your leg up, taking pictures and stuff. Well, we just went to the winery, so. My question to you all, is it okay if your significant other or your spouse uh, go on a trip? So we want to know what you guys think. Emily Dunlap said, it's courteous to ask if you're married or in a committed relationship. Uh, Gwen James says, he can go, but we want to, we're going to both agree that it's okay. We have to make sure this trip isn't interfering with anything at home. Exactly. Now, who's saying that? That's what Gwen James said. Gwen James, know what to say. Tawana says, uh, McQuarrie says, uh, they did that in old days. Nowadays, they just do what they want that want. Uh, that's why marriage do not last long. Kawana says, <laughs> I can go, but I just can't tell Tucker I'm going like that. Period. Mm -mm. Uh, a wall Becca says nothing wrong with going, but a mutual respect and conversation should be had. Lord. So you guys tell us what you think. Is it okay if I come to you and I say, honey, me and the girls are going on a trip next week. Is it okay? If, I mean, I ain't asking you. Me. You can say it. Uh huh. But that don't mean you finna go. What you mean? I mean, you just ain't gonna tell me you going on no trip and expect to be gone on it or whatever. I mean, but I'm grown. I'm I'm old forty years old. Yeah, you about by fifty, but you just ain't gonna go on no trip and let that be like that. We ain't never done that, and we ain't gonna start doing it. Okay. I mean, I mean, the way I look at it, I just can't go, can? Huh? Can? I? What you think about that? Can no, I? No, you can barely go to the shopping bag. Exactly. Right. So you know, you, I can't go on no trip. So uh -huh. no, we ain't doing that. We ain't doing that. So you guys tell us what you you think and please share out the broadcast and type in shared at the bottom if you guys don't mind. Uh share out the broadcast the way I feel and about type it. in share at the way, bottom. The way I feel about it. Uh-huh. Now mm -hmm. now and it's just me in my opinion, because I'm entitled to my own opinion and all that type of mm -hmm. stuff. If you trying to go somewhere and all and talk about going on a little trip, I mean I don't mind, but let let like like somebody was saying, we're gonna see if everything good if the you call Everybody's situation is different. With us, we got these kids and all. We got to make sure the kid in place and everything straight and mm -hmm. the money in place ain't going ain't gonna to affect nothing. What's up, Erica Glenn? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> ain't ain't going to affect nothing about you going. And then if that cool, then adios amigos. Or however you say that, you can adios. go. Well, adios. So the money in place, the children in place, I'm going. And then I got to see where you going and all that stuff. And I'm, gonna have to I'm see going to Miami. Miami. Well, you know, if that's what you want to do. Yeah. So I can go. 
But after you get back though, then I'm booking me one. No, you ain't, you ain't going nowhere. You crazy. No, you ain't going. How do you want to pick? You can go then, I can't go. Because I can. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. yeah. Felicia Brown says, Felicia Brown says, um, yes, yeah, she should ask because of common courtesy of being married. There has to be an agreement. You can tell she, run the, she runs that house. Uh, Tali says, I allowed that wrong decisions. There was deception behind it that I didn't know about it. I'm a different place in my life now the trust has to be there now and mutual agreement um has to be met depends on the situation kawana says we got to talk about it what's going on all the time and where i'm going and is everything at home taken care of likewise it has to be communicated to the t um karita says i agree it's respect now let's now let the man try to come to his wife and say he is going with the guy's trip and in the and end of story. Wrong decision. Um, Anthony says, all jokes aside, there has to be a long conversation, but the answer is still no. That's what he said. Jennifer Crowder said, it's all about clear, open communication and mutual respect. <laughs> um, uh, thank you, Kathy Easter. Thank you, Karanja Story. Thank you, Beverly Holt, uh, for, for sharing. Also, Willie J. Hall, thank you for sharing. And Gwendolyn Kyles. Um, Karanja says, Pastor Story says, y'all can go to Miami this weekend. Go ahead. Is, is that cool? Uh, he might be talking about us, not, <laughs> not you. Oh, I not mean. me. I don't know. I don't uh, she was saying that I'm setting setting you up for a girl's trip. Corey, she said, I see it coming. She talking about I'm just trying to set up for a girl's trip. That's right. Who said that? Sheba did. That sound like me too, Sheba. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to add that little thing and, and, and to trick the king. I ain't going for it. I ain't tricking the king. I know you ain't. Because I come and say, hey, I'm, I want to go to this trip and we going. That's no, we ain't going. I'm going to tell you right about now. I'm going to look, the pandemic out and ain't no going nowhere, no trip right now. And I'm going to say, well, I'm, it's already booked. Well, I'm going to say, you better unbook it. Uh, I'm booked. Because ain't, no, ain't, ain't, ain't nobody going nowhere now. Well, I'm I can't get no now. money back in this well, book. Well, then the money just... Lost. Well, you stay here with yeah. these kids. You just lost the money that time. You go up. You nah, if it wasn't no pandemic, uh -huh. I might can see different. But uh -huh. by being a pandemic out here, uh -huh. I ain't, you don't need to I'm going to see right you now. up there with daddy for the weekend. And you go, you and the children stay with daddy for the weekend. And then I'm gone. <laughs> <laughs> you stay with daddy for the whole weekend. And I'm going to leave book out on a Friday. And I'll be back Monday. Y'all just stay with daddy for the whole weekend. We'll, we'll make sure you got the breakfast, lunch, and dinner for daddy, and then the kids, and then we out. Boy, I'm gonna plead the fifth. <laughs> oh, King, gonna plead the fifth on that. Well, I ain't gonna say nothing. Yolanda Thomas says, uh, It's all about the trust issue. If you trust her, Corey, and you know deep down in your heart you have a good wife, don't worry, she is grown. What's up, Fannin? You hear her? She said, I don't, I don't, I don't care if she go. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't, I, I'm not trying to keep them. Cause I, I feel like this about life and people and marriage and all. I don't want my wife to be unhappy by no means. Mm -hmm. So if everything cool, my wife can go to Missouri. She can go to, I don't care where she goes. She can go where she want to go. Uh -huh. As long as everything cool around here and everything good, then go. I'm going to miss her and everything, but I'll see her when she get back. And she can go. I ain't gonna be calling her every minute and stuff like that. Every hour calling like folk be doing me. And she just go and that be. Oh, it. I don't call you. Oh, if, if you claiming I call you, I don't call you. You do be calling me. No, I don't call you. Tell my kid to the shop. You call. Man, I don't be calling you. Try to make sure I'm up there. Are stuff. you kidding me? I ain't no, you kidding I me. I ain't fine trying to find you. Yeah, you stay calling me. Man, I don't stay calling you. You, so you don't think you be calling me? No. Oh, it be an imposter. <laughs> oh what? An imposter? No. You be calling me, lady. No, I don't. Man, you be calling me. Time I get the shop good. That's what kind. Of, no, what that girl want? Oh, they got you. <laughs> <laughs> You're calling to see what you're doing. I am working. That's what I'm trying to work. I can't work. You calling me? <laughs> then hang up. I will tell about about an hour later. <laughs> she calling again. I, mean, I know the girl won't so. And be calling me like 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 she think I don't work for real. I'm up here doing these for help. You know what I'm saying, y'all? I'm up here, like, parting the thing, splitting the forehead, finna put the relax on. I got gloves on. I got relaxers up in my hand. I don't have that ear stuff because I don't like that. So I'm trying to, you know, work. And next day, I know this lady, I just left. I ain't been gone for now 35, 40 minutes. This lady already calling me. 
What you doing? I'm working. And I don't want to not answer call by being my wife and, you know, I got kids and stuff. So I might be going on. So I answer the phone just knowing something wrong. I get, what's up, honey? What you doing? <laughs> what I'm doing? Um, I'm working, honey. I'm on somebody's head. Oh. Then she be going so slow. Talk fast. I'm I'm busy. Talk fast. Just say what you gonna say and let it be it. Don't be sorry. I ain't got time for that bedroom talk to them now. I'm at work. You do that jump when I ain't doing that and try to, you know, get me on home. That when you're supposed to do that. When I'm about to work or something, then you go to talking slow and, and all marinating and everything to get me him. Let me I'm trying to tell you how they work. Don't you be calling me when I dead left. <laughs> I ain't been going no time. I mean, got dog. His brother trying to work, can't work. Don't. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ain't no okay. I, 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 I will now, now, don't you not uh, call okay. now. I can't I, I, you call you know check on me every I'll be while. checking to see, do you need something to eat? But i let you stall down there at that shop. Don't worry about that. No. I'll be trying to make sure you straight. But, baby, you ain't got to worry about me because I want to make sure you straight. You get them crackers from them old ladies out their pocketbook. Tell, no, tell them no. to bring, you, bring them sandwiches in their pocketbook and give you them sandwiches. So, now you be hungry when you down there. So, I'll be trying to say, hey, you ate? Huh? You okay? But now, baby, you ain't got to worry about that. No, but I'm talking about if I just left oh, him no, no. Oh, with okay. Breakfast and breakfast. Oh, okay. Like I'm I leave here at nine. You know, I ain't hungry at ten. When I, I, when I know you ain't, ain't cooked you no know, breakfast, I'm just saying, are you hungry? But well, you, you should have cooked me something. Uh, uh, no, Clyde, you cook your own sandwich. But don't worry about it. I don't it. messed up now. Yeah, you done messed <laughs> up. That mouth will get you in trouble. But, baby, the power lie in the tongue, and you just spoke real clear. What about it? I said, no. I'm sorry. No, he <laughs> said, don't bang down now. <laughs> don't bang down now. Because you know I'm always saying, do you need something? I'm just calling before I leave the area, before I get away. I'm just trying to see, do you need anything? That I'm trying to check on the king. Make sure king's straight. But king done met himself all the way up, y'all. So y'all bring him some sandwiches down now. That's what well, he I'm going to need you, Tony. <laughs> nah. You know, Brooke, boy, I look like king don't stick his foot in the mouth. But she still don't want to call all that many times. I mean, I, oh, a couple of times. I mean, I just get in there. <laughs> don't worry. I don't need some help, boy. <laughs> don't worry. Hey. Don't worry. Some of y'all, somebody got to help the king get a little snack I, or something. I hope guy. they do bring you some snacks. I'll be hungry now. now. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to take my little old doggy bag. Yeah, you got him. That old brown sack. I'm going to have my old sack line because it look like I ain't even getting there. Um, I don't think we've ever been on a trip. With our friends, I I haven't and left you here, um, and you haven't either. So yeah, I know if I do, what the hell? What what would happen? You don't think I'm understanding? Yeah, I think you understand. Oh uh, yeah, I'm understanding. By the time I'm riding around the road on that motor, like, brrr, brrr, that, that, that thing keep vibrating. Oh, that what it gonna do? Yeah. What would it? Do? I got uh -huh. pull over, pull over. He swear I be calling him. There go you. What's up, BTV? Now, don't you know I ain't even got the Phoenix City yet. I'm trying to get to Panama City. I bad it on made on 280. And, and what's going on? I just call and see. See how y'all, how far y'all don't got. Well, nowhere. I had to pull over. I ain't got nowhere but on 280 because by the time I dig out the backwater. And now you don't call. And I ain't saying don't check on me, but just let me get the dope or something. Let me get going a little further. Okay. All right. All right. I'll talk to you. All right. I love you, man. Mmm. Let that get the Oh, what Hello? Where y'all at now? <laughs> Shoot! <laughs> in the same spot! Yeah, I, I crumped back up! And you call again! <laughs> I mean, I don't want to be, you know, I don't want to act like I ain't appreciating the call that you concern me. God dog it! Now go ahead with this thing, cause we gotta get out of here and go to work. <laughs> I mean, you know, I guess you just be missing the king. I don't know what it be. That would it be. You be missing the king. I mean, that would it be. She be missing the king, boy. She, she don't want the king to get nowhere.